Hello friends, welcome back to Sale 3D Pro Tips and Tricks YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to give you one more uh, tricks for creating uh, quick cross sections. In last video, we have seen how we can generate a uh, detailed cross section uh, by using the alignment and uh, you can create a cross section anywhere and uh, with any angle you want. Uh, now I'm going to show you uh, another trick for creating quick cross section. For that, what you need to do, suppose I want my uh, any section here to see how the ground is behaving. So what I can do, I just generate a polyline from where to where I require my section. So I click over here. Okay. And once you're done, you go to the profile option and select the quick profile and select that polyline. Now it's asking you what surface you want to show. So you select the surface and deselect uh, which you don't want. And you can select also style. Now click OK and place it anywhere on the ground. So, yep. So by this, you can quickly generate a section for your existing ground and you can see how your existing ground is behaving. So this is one more method. Uh, the drawback of this tricks is that you can't generate any level around here. So that's the problem and uh, of course you can generate, uh, you can see what level over here or you can uh, see what grade is here. You need to select this and you go to annotation tool and you can label this and you can see what levels and the slope uh, is here. Also it will not save. So once you save your drawing, this section will disappear. So that's another topic of this method. Another way of doing quick cross section is go to uh, tool space, go to toolbox and in miscellaneous utility surface you can see here quick cross section. So you can select this, execute, select your surface and click enter. Now it's asking you two method either multiple points or either three points. So I'll select with the three points. I select my point here and here and now it is asking me direction let's click here and now it is asking me where you want to place the section so I'll just click over here and now it is asking me all the styles you want to give so you, if you propose ground or exit down this is existing I select this I can select the hexagon and also the band style so I'll click OK and you can see the section is here also the drawback of this method is that you can just quite, uh, quickly look on the sections and the label. Once the moment you click on the screen, it will disappear. So this is also like if you want to quickly see what is going on the ground existing, how the level are behaving, where the slope is going. So you can do it by with this method. So yeah, these are the three methods of quickly generating cross section in Civil 3D. So thank you. Thanks for watching our videos.